Well, this morning we're learning how complicated it could be for Indiana's Department of Child Services to actually make changes to protect kids. That's right. A new report actually showing the number of Hoosier children that die from abuse or neglect each year. Marlissa Raymond's following this for us this morning. She joins us with What's Next Now for DCS. Hey, Alyssa. Hey, Ben. Hey, Julia. Good morning. DCS administrators and lawmakers agree the state needs to do a better job protecting its children. I mean, just listen to these numbers. According to the report released yesterday in 2016, 59 children died as a result of abuse or neglect. That's actually down from 77 deaths the year before that. But then this, three out of four of the children who died were three years or younger. Marion County had 14 child abuse or neglect deaths, the most in the state, followed by Allen, Elkhart, and Tippecanoe counties. So now, what's being done about this? First, DCS and other lawmakers are taking a look at the response time, and there's a lot of back and forth just going on about this. One recommendation was a DCS worker needs to respond immediately. Another was, yes, immediately, but no longer than four hours after suspected abuse or neglect. DCS also wants to eliminate poverty as a single factor for determining whether parents are neglecting their children. Another problem we know, Alyssa, has got to be money. We always hear how mm -hmm. these workers are overworked and underpaid, but now there is some money that's uh, going to be offered? Yes, and this is just another reminder. This is what Matt McCutcheon talked about yesterday morning on Sunrise, that the governor recently pledged $25 million to DCS from that state's rainy day fund, so that'll go towards hiring at least 75 Four people. Mm -hmm. And we'll keep following their process to improve DCS. A lot to follow. Alyssa, thank you very much.